So, perfect blue skies, almost no wind, beautiful sunshine. These are indeed conditions for the beautiful game. The backdrop here, picturesque, idyllic. No doubt one of the best days of the footballing calendar and it has added to a really jovial, happy mood in the stands, helping to raise the level of sound by more than a few decibels. Shirt sleeve order, very much a dress code. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. And we rise now for the Spanish national anthem. down the gauntlet with that anthem now to match it two high-profile, high-caliber teams. This is a welcome event for all these supporters. Yes, Peter, it's a shame it's only a, a friendly, but then again, that may help us see a more expressive attacking contest. And I'd be prepared to settle for a, a clash of, of lesser intensity in favor of, of lots of flair, skill, and plenty of tricks, and a few goals. I suspect I've probably overstretched my, my level of greed here. That's got things on the way. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Jordi Alba. He's got such searing pace, Peter. He gets to the byline in the blink of an eye. And from there, his crosses are, are pinpoint and very hard to defend against. Gets up to head it! Good delivery, but no joy. Well, plenty of moving targets to pick out in the box. Obviously increases your chances of the ball being met like that by someone Sergio Busquets doesn't get the pass he's looking for and it's Suba now a chance to break Eric Garcia, Raspilicueta. Cuts it out. Sakaria. It's come loose. Get a throw in. Koke. Koke with towering header. Gets it back. Raspilicueta. Koke. And the whistle's gone, presumably for offside. Seferovic spreads it towards the left. Koke. 
Neither side yet able to find the net. That'll be a throw in. Loses his balance and loses the ball. And here's Morata. Plays it back. It has Morata shoots! Well read, he sorted that out. Now it's Seferovic. Switzerland seem happy to let their strikers roam out wide. I wouldn't want that. No? No, well, my worry is that their, their main threat is being shifted out of contention. Hits one! Goal, Spain! And it's Spain who take the lead! Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. A 1-0 lead established. Well, just listen to the reaction. I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium. Bolo kings it out wide. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. Good challenge. He just stood firm. Well, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. The ball's loose, and he's after it. Well, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Well, he can't say now that he hasn't been warned. Well, I think the referee would have told him to rein it in or, or suffer the consequences. It's Safedovic! Oh, what a wonderful stop! The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Played it short. Good defending, albeit from an unexpected source. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team really, your striker should be the first line of that defence, and, and he's delivering. Face to face. Morata! And he heaves it forward. Spain have it back, and they can go again. And it's Koke. Jordi Alba has it out wide and in space. Great leap! I think that's offside. Yes, it is. Keeper's got good distance on that. It's the whistle for half time. Well, there we are, off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Any opinion you'd like to express on the first half? Well, I think there's plenty to be pleased about with that first half display in terms of the score and, and overall approach. Spain come off having scored the only goal of the game so far. It's been tight, it's been exciting. There is certainly plenty for us to chew on during the break. Already up and running for the second half. Spain carrying a one-goal lead. He's there to receive it. Big chance! And that's caused a worry or two. Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though.
as Pliqueta battles to win it back. Zuba cuts a frustrated figure right now, he just cannot get away. Ah, uh, he needs a minder, and one of his teammates should be picking up on that, and quickly. Jordi Alba, massive leap, back of the net! A two-goal lead, and they're firmly in control. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. That was all very well drilled. Spain take a two-goal lead and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. He's had a goal! Yes! And the lead is extended still further. And as soon as they made that error in midfield, they didn't have time to react before the ball hit the net. Very much a lesson learned. Spain take a three-goal lead and they are romping out of sight. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. Switzerland going about it patiently, perhaps too patiently. Looking to break out here. Nicely measured pass. And the flag has stayed down. He's had a shot. In for the pieces. It's a goal. It could be a lifeline. Two more needed. De Gea did well the first time. Nothing he could do about the follow-up. Well, look, regardless of whether the keeper could have done better or not, Peter, that was all down to the excellent movement in getting into the right position to apply the final touch. So, just a consolation, or is there a way back from here? Morata looking as though he's being given special treatment here. Treatment he could well do without. Well, his stealth has been compromised because of his goal, and his treatment from here looks as if it could get a little tighter. And it's Mbolo. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. And that's going to be a booking. Sometimes a loose foul can trigger a completely different spell of play and uh, it makes even less sense. Seferovic. Well, that's a foul and the whistle's gone. And the referee has shown him a yellow card. Rodriguez! That's a fine save. Well, I thought his starting position was good and that helped the keeper to judge the flight of the ball and, and deal with it well. Seferovic has it in a wide position, so what next? Oh, that's clearly not what he wanted to do. Final checks on the touchline. A change about to occur. Well, he's worked so hard for his side. Uh, as you would expect, but 
you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. Oh, that is asking for trouble. Flings it across. Sakari. It's broken loose. Aimed in towards the centre. Timely intervention. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No. It's probably cautionary uh, don't dive in try to pinch it or or intercept so nobody can get in behind Busquets has given away a free kick no hesitation he's straight into his pocket it's a second yellow card and he walks well, the players are making their point but the ref clearly isn't interested he's waved them all away well, there may be some scope for debate over the seriousness of the offence, but none over its repercussions. We'll have to see out the rest of the game with ten men. And it's got through. He's been bundled over, that is a foul. He knows what's coming, a second yellow, and he's off. Tempers are flaring, the referee really needs to get a grip again. Well, they are now a nine-man team. Up to meet it! Oh, just couldn't turn it in. No, that was a slick move, and there were several options in the box to, uh, to pick out. to get it forward quickly that is very well defended that's one way of trying to make things happen there's a few who could follow that example he's picked him out it's been intercepted and that will come to nothing Sommer sends that along yeah that does look a foul referee's given a free kick Sakaria knocks it away and it's Ruiz it's a loose ball added time is up and there goes the whistle Spain come away with the win a job really well done in all departments a real some of the parts team effort how do you look back on the game then Jim well at the moment